If you're comfortable with the basis of the calendar, there are some fun features called labs that you can use to enhance your calendar experience. How you get to the labs is you go over to the settings gear icon, click on the menu icon, and pick labs. What they'll explain to you is labs are experimental features that they say aren't ready for prime time. And they do warn you that they may change or break or disappear. But I'll tell you something, um, I really haven't seen any of them that I've are interested to you. And if it's something interesting you, you click enable. Like for example, automatically declining events. It lets you block off times in your calendar when you're unavailable. Invitation sets for any events are automatically declined. So that's kind of a cool feature. All you have to do is click Enable. Event Attachments. You Google Doc or a spreadsheet to an event or upload one from your file and it says important guests do not automatically have permission to view the attachments. You must share attachments. But if you do a lot of things with Google, they're really awesome to enable this feature. So the best part is you attach the document and it becomes part of the email. You have a little icon down at the bottom. One that's also fun, Event Flare, bring your calendar to life by adding fun flare gadgets. Background image is a pretty one. One that I do really like is Jump to Date, so you can quickly navigate around. And I also like Next Meeting, it gives you a warning. So any ones that you want, you enable, and you can always disable them. And make sure you click Save. And where they appear, actually appear over on the right side of your screen. So see I have Event Flare, select an event to add to, jump to date, and next meeting. I, there we go. So they will appear over in the right hand side of your screen. Play with them, they're kind of fun.